Doctors will soon cost you more. New federal rules take effect in April that require them to be more efficient. Good morning, Indiana anchor Beth Vaughn now with how to know if your water heater is on its last leg. Water heater regulations are about to change and in the long run could save you money. Your water heater is the second largest consumer of energy in your home, right behind your heating and cooling system. So any improvement in your water heater's efficiency is going to pay dividends in your monthly utility bills. The standards call for higher energy factor ratings on all home, gas, electric, oil, and tankless water heaters. But the most dramatic changes will be for bigger models, over 55 gallons, typically found in larger homes. You will have to buy a heat pump water heater and those water heaters on top of them will have a compressor and a evaporator coil, a whole refrigeration system similar to what your refrigerator has in order to heat the water cheaper. Chip Cochran says that's double or triple the price of a typical new water heater if it's in that larger category. And if your current water heater is in a crawl space or utility closet, an updated model may not fit. It's going to be bigger, it's going to be taller, it's going to take up more room. A lot of water heaters are installed in a very tight quarters, so all these things could be a major impact when you're replacing a water heater after April 2015. Angie's List says if your water heater is more than a decade old and it's in a location where a leak could cause damage, you need to think about replacing it quickly. A lot of people like to wait until a water heater fails. They use the theory of why fix it if it's not broke. The problem with that is it never breaks at a convenient time. To find out how old your water heater is, check out the serial numbers. A professional should be able to decode its age and gallon capacity. While increased energy efficiency will decrease operating costs, you may have to pay more for regular maintenance because of more complex designs and electronics. Beth Vaughn, RTV6.